Hey everyone, it's Martin here, one hour playthrough. Thanks for joining me on the second video in this uh, mini series of 16, uh, where we where I'm collecting uh, Daedric artifacts. And right now, um, for the next one, I am in Winterhold and we go to the Shrine of Azura. And the best way to go is fast travel to Winterhold. It's also better and first to go to Winterhold and not directly to the Shrine of Azura whilst undiscovered, while you have uh, Winterhold undiscovered. Because uh, after this, after the Shrine visit, we have to go back to Winterhold so we can fast travel. So, um, the Shrine of Azura, I think it's on that mountain. We can't see it yet in the compass, but there will be soon. And I think, is he giving us any grief? There it is. So straight forward in my compass, that's the shrine. Yeah, there it is. Nice. Okay, bye Wolfie. Um, let's go th uh, this way, I think. Oh, I forgot. You have to go around the mountain. I consider this one of the best Daedric artifacts. Um, I'm going for the basically the black soul gem because that's eventually what it is. Um, let's see, did I take the good path? I think I did. I think there's two ways to get there eventually. This should do. Feels a bit like the long way, but bye doggies. Oh, Whoa, look at him. <laughs> because um this um so you have the white star of Azura and the black one and the black one you can capture um souls of humans and those are always grand soul gems. But it holds white jaw soul gems as well. Okay, let me quickly show you in a second on the map where we are. I'll do a quick save as well before the game crashes. So it's basically right underneath Winterhold, yes. Yeah, so you can have a better look like this. And we have to talk to this lady. Azura has seen your coming, traveler. It was not curiosity but fate that has led you here. That or a YouTube video. <laughs> um, what is this place and who is Azura? This shrine was built by the Dunma. As our land was scorched by fire and brimstone, Azura's prophecies led us to safety. She is a Daedra, a powerful being who watches from beyond our mortal plane. She has chosen you to be her champion. Alright, very well. So, what does Azura need? You must go to a fortress, endangered by water, yet untouched by it. Mm -hmm. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know, but Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they know this elven enchanter. We'll do. May so magic that's Azura. Alright. So, next thing we do, we have to fast travel. Back to Winterhold. Okay, so when you arrive, just My go in into the inn. Not waste time the frozen heart. I'm sorry, could you describe the smell? Like some horrible monster was turned inside out and then exploded. The mages don't let us go in the what college. Did you do? They said it's not safe in there. Right, then you shouldn't. Already corrected it for future experiments. This, this guy right over here. This is why people have a problem with your college, Nelikar. I don't deal with any college applic- My days at the college are long behind me, but I prefer to stay close by. I'm looking for an elven mage who studies stars. Who sent you? 
Was it the college? The Jarl? We agreed there would be no more questions. Well, actually, it was the priestess of Azura that sent me. You're working with the Daedra? Right. Now tell me the one about the Argonian maid and the lusty baron. I don't know that one, but um, how about if I pay you 142 gold? A few coins for my soul. If only you understood the irony. What do you know about soul gems? Well, um, they're for enchanting, right? They are, except the gem is always consumed. They're frail, except for one. Azura's star. A daedric artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. Some of us wanted to find out how. I was working under Malin Varen then. If only we knew what he was really planning. So, who is this Malin? Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying, disease. He thought he could store his own soul inside, become immortal. It drove him mad. Students started dying. Eventually, the college exiled him. He took a few loyal disciples to Illinolta's deep and vanished. Look, I don't care who asked you to find the star, but don't take it back to Azura. The Daedra are evil. They're the reason Malin went insane. I see. All right. Until next time. Until next time, sir. The major Let's go get the, the star. They said it's not and we get that sorry can't you just shut up <laughs> all right so um this is the castle untouched by water and i think yeah the easiest part is that uh, i fast travel to anisa's cabin and just on horseback it's not such a long ride okie dokie let's ride easiest way is just Go towards the water and stay along the shore. So many doggies. There it is. we go. Um. <laughs> I know there's a book somewhere over here. Yeah, let me just quickly have a look at it. Somewhere in this dungeon. Let's see. Yeah. What was that? bits and bobs here.
It was in a disadvantage when they get up. There. Oh, I see. Oh, there you are. Oh, good for you. Holy shit. Uh. Hang on. Uh. That was a serious amount of damage. I'm not even sure on uh, which level I'm playing. <laughs> To be honest, couldn't be that high. Just keeping my eyes out for the book. I know there's one somewhere. that one <coughs> uh, no. nothing I need hang on oh no no I'm good Almost thought I missed it, but no, 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 I'm good. More souls are needed for the star. The last one died before he could be harvested. Huh? That's something else. <laughs> Your friend dies and then you bring him back to life. There's lots of fragments here we don't need. Maybe we need to solve them later. There it is. Yeah. But I thought there was another book here as well. Um, just some loot. There's somewhere a black soul gem. Did I already pick it up? Some fragments. Hmm. I think you can get a black soul gem over here. Actually, let me check something. Maybe my conjuration. So I want to have um, Mystic Bindings for this character and Soul Stealer. Yeah. Let's do this one first. Anything good? Oh yeah, Conjuration. That's not better than what I have, is it? Just checking. I have, of course, um, that's very good actually. All along, I had this with me. Hang on. <sighs> really? Don't <laughs> you hate it? <laughs> Did it ever happen to you? Oh, holy shit. Alright then. Novice ropes, fine. Oh, 
shot too early. Doesn't really matter. Alright. There it is. It's mine. Oh, mine. Not yours, bandit. And there's the other book. Oh, this is the... No, 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 that's not it. But that's fine as well. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Now, you either have a choice now, um, which you have to make. You can see this on the map as well. You either go back to... Um, the Shrine of Azura and you get the white star or you go back to Winterhold which I'm going to do and I'll take the black star My job is to serve the Jarl not waste time talking with travelers <laughs> Who is starting? Alright, let's speak to this guy again Where is he? If there's anything you need, just let me know where is he? Oh, there you are. I told you what you wanted to know. What else could you want? Well, let me sit down and I'll tell you. Stendar's mercy. You found it. Azora's star. Maybe this is my chance to make things right. I can finish Malin's work the way we had meant to before his madness. It would mean cutting the star off from Azora. Only black souls would be able to enter it once we finished. Let's do it. Give me a minute to examine the star. I'll see what we'll need to do. These fissures and cracks aren't encouraging. All right, Malin all right, obviously was growing more desperate once he left the college. Oh, by the way, there's a staff there, always. He did it. He actually managed to trap his own soul inside the star, but it's falling apart. It needs more and more souls to sustain itself. The star is being used to sustain Malin's soul. I can't fix it while that fragment of him is inside. You see, so we need to deal with Malin somehow. Precisely, but it's not as simple as enchanting Malin away. He's put up barriers. Souls are only allowed in, not out. If we were to somehow send a soul inside the star, one that was ready to overpower Malin from the inside... <laughs> I don't like where this is going. I could soul trap you, place you inside the star, then bring you back once Malin has been dealt with. I understand if you need some time to prepare. Let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. Let's just enter the star and get it over with. Okay. Stand very still. This might sting. First, I'll need to grab hold of your soul. Now, take a deep breath. Ah, my disciples have sent me a fresh soul. Good. I was getting... hungry. Why? There's something different about you. You can't escape your fate, Malin. And who are you to challenge me? I have conquered mortality itself. I've spat in the eyes of the Daedric Lords. This is my realm now. I've sacrificed too much to let you take it from me. Really? Oh, I should miss. I hate these flames. Come walk, thank you. Or just you have to loot these because they have Daedra hearts, which are pretty rare. And if you want to make Daedra armor, which you should, because it's fantastic and it looks really damn sexy, then you need these hearts. No, not like this. 
Malin's enchantments are broken. Hold on. I'm going to pull your soul out of there. Brace yourself. Oh, no, no. Don't. Oh, God. There's was still one alive. I didn't notice it was Malin there. Am I in time? Damn it. <laughs> Balls. I should have paid attention. Easy there. The numbness will pass. Just don't strain yourself. We've done it. The star has been cut from Azora, and Malin's soul finally has some measure of peace, even if it is non-existence. So, what do we do with it now, then? Now? You could use it for what we meant it for. Using black souls for enchanting. The mm. black star will never decay, but it can no longer hold the white souls of lesser creatures. You keep it. I'd sooner finally put this chapter of my life behind me. Congratulations. You've changed the fate of a Daedric artifact and lived. Nice. Excellent. So, there we go. All right, then. Let's have a look. Black Star. Yeah. I think it's fantastic. All right. So, um, yeah, that concludes uh, episode number two of this series. I'd like to thank you very much for watching and hope to see you next time. Um, you'll see, I'm not going to spoil you yet which uh, artifact we're going to get next. So stay tuned. Thank you for watching. Bye.